There's one simple method that will get you out of bed no matter what. You can use this method especially for days when you went to bed way too late and the best part is you only need one thing. So when do you normally get up? Around 7? around 8. It's rare that someone says they're getting out of bed before 6. Why do you think that is the case? One reason. Because they go to bed late. And of course your body wants his 7 or 8 hours of sleep. But if you want to be successful, the question is not when will you go to bed? The question is what are you actually doing before you go to bed? 99% will say I'm watching TV or I'm watching Netflix. So in order to get out of bed earlier, you have to cut this time. But that's not why you clicked on the video. You don't want a boring explanation that you should go to bed earlier and that you should cut your time in front of the TV. You want that one little trick that gets you out of bed no matter what. And it exists. Because also as an entrepreneur, you will not go to bed every single day at point 10 o'clock. You have to be able to get up early no matter what, no matter how late that last business meeting was. Maybe you've worked late, that one offer had to be ready for your client tomorrow, the presentation wasn't finished. Or maybe you just had an awesome night with your spouse, maybe you went to the cinema. Whatever it is, you need that one method in order to get out of bed early. So you go to bed at 12 and you have to wake up at 5. Here's what you have to do. You set your alarm clock, it doesn't matter if it's a normal one or if it's your phone, just usual as always. And then you do this one magical thing. You place your alarm on the doorstep to the next room. This way you are forced to wake up and forced to get up as soon as the alarm goes off. You won't be able to put off the alarm without standing up. You have to get up. You have to go to the doorstep and snooze the alarm over there. And by that time, you're already up. The risk of you sleeping longer than you should are drastically reduced. And if you are a die-hard sleeper, I recommend not putting the phone or the alarm onto the doorstep to the next room, but put it into the next room where you have to be after getting up, most likely the bathroom. But over there, put the alarm even louder so you will still be able to hear the alarm when it goes off. So you wake up, have to go to the bathroom, you're already in the bathroom and now you're awake. Congratulations! You got up and ready to start your day. We've just pushed your wake up time from 6 to 5. You have one additional hour, use it with intent, do something with it. So as always, I hope you got value out of this video and I hope you can use this one method don't use it every single day because you as a leader should always put your health on a high position. So I recommend you to get your seven or eight hours of sleep, but you can use this method if you had a special evening or a long day of work the, night, the day prior. I hope I'll see you next time. Until then, see ya.